looking very dapper. Tell me about what okay. you're wearing, you. please. Okay. You want to know what? I really don't know. I think this is uh, Zara. This is what I think this is. I think I got some supers on. It's Zara. And these jeans are awesome. I don't know what they are. That's the beauty about the beauty. being a star and showing no, up on a red carpet. I just try to make it look good. I don't know if it's working. It's totally working. It's totally working. So now that this project is in completion, I mean, we're going to see it on TV very shortly. What are you most excited for fans to see? I want them to take the message away, you know, being yourself. You know, just it's just so important just to let who you are shine, have your own personality. That's why we're all individuals. That's why we don't look the same because yeah. we're supposed to be unique. And I think that's what this movie is about, is no matter what being who you are. Yeah, and for anyone who's not familiar, what's the storyline? The storyline is basically about this kid who's very shy but is very talented, and his best friend who is not shy but is not ta who's not shy but is not talented at all, and he kind of you know takes over his whole persona of who he is, but nobody really knows. So it's kind of like this whole love triangle where the girl falls in love with me, which she's supposed to be with him. <laughs> this is a whole bunch of stuff. It's exciting though, and there's dancing music, and it's just, it's just such a great time. Which song on the soundtrack is your favorite? What do you have stuck in your head? Me and you. Is it gonna be me and you? Is it gonna be? No, it's Coco's song. And she's so, she's so, so talented. The way she sings it is just so emotional. And you know, when I hear it, it's just like, it makes the story that much better when you hear it. Because it's such a turning point in the story when she sings it. And it's, it's great. I've heard the, the finale performance is just amazing. What can we look forward to with it? You can look forward to mighty dancing, mighty singing. And just, you know, just a family kind of environment. The whole the whole thing, you see us three, you know, on stage just really interacting with each other and we have that chemistry because I think we really are that way in real life. You got to shoot in, in um, I almost said Australia, but I meant Atlanta. <laughs> Atlanta, the ATL. Yeah, what was it like out there? It was amazing. Um, the food was number one on my list. We had the South City Kitchen, the strip, the macaroni and cheese, the steak, everything was awesome. Uh, the people were very awesome. It was so green there. Like you, know, we don't have as much green here in LA, but in Atlanta, there's so much green. It's so, you know, environment friendly, and it's just a beautiful place to be. Straight from you, one of the stars of Let It Shine. Why should we all tune in to the Disney Channel? You should tune in if you love music, if you love dancing, and you should tune in because everyone can relate to this story. It's something somebody has a crush on somebody there's always going to be you know that kind of weirdness of should you say it or not and it's just something that everyone can relate to everyone's had a crush on someone everyone's you know found something they love and they just got to go for it what's your message about following your dreams that's exactly it there's no other way nothing else you can do it's one life to live why waste it you know go all the way